Hello and welcome to my Surfer SEO tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Surfer SEO for beginners. So if you want to know what is Surfer SEO, how to use it properly, and you want a complete demo of this tool, complete review of this tool, then this video is for you. Because in this video, I'm going to cover each and every tool of Surfer SEO in detail. So if you are a beginner, then you will understand how to use it like a pro. So watch this video till the end. And I want to mention one more thing that if you want to follow along, then I will give the link of Surfer SEO free trial in the video description so just uh, click on that link and activate surfer seo free trial to try surfer seo for free for next seven days to decide surfer seo is worth your money or not so without any further delay let's get started so surfer seo is a one of the best on page seo optimization tool that help you to optimize your article for seo okay so if you want to write new article or if you want to update your existing article in that case you can use surfer seo to make your article fully seo optimized so Surfer SEO comes with some great tools like keyword research, content editor, content audit, domain planner, SERP analyzer, and grow flow tool. Okay, and by the way, this grow flow tool is not for new customers now, it is only for existing customers. So, you uh, when you will purchase Surfer SEO, then you will see these tools keyword research, content editor, content audit, domain planner, and SERP analyzer. Okay, so I'm going to cover each and every tool in detail. So, very first tool is keyword research tool. So, keyword research tool is mainly used for doing the keyword research. So so if uh, you want to get some content idea and if you want to build topical authority in your niche in that case you can use this keyword research tool so as you can see when you will click on this keyword research section then you will see a dashboard like this from here you can enter your target keyword for example if you want to do keyword research related to weight loss then you can write weight loss here and you can click on this create keyword research button when you will click on it then it will take two to three minutes and surfer seo will do complete analysis for you so i have already done so there is two methods so one is with topical map and another is without topical map so if you will enable this option then it will create entire topical map for your target keyword and if you will disable it then it will give you some keyword ideas related to your niche like informational transactional like this so i have already created keyword research for weight loss with topical map and without topical map so first i'm going to show you how it will look if i will enable this topic map button if i will enable it then it will look something like this as you can see in the screen right now so what it will do it will divide your main topic i have entered weight loss so it will divide weight loss to multiple categories as you can see uh, topics means category okay so topics means category it will divide your main keyword into multiple category and for each category it will give you lots of content idea like one pillar page and some supporting page suppose uh, natural weight loss i will select it then you can write a main article around natural weight loss method and after that what you can do you can create some supporting topic and after that you can build internal link between these pages to support your pillar page okay i hope you got it similarly there are lots of lots of uh, categories like plant based weight loss so as you can see they you will get multiple idea and there are lots of lots of category as you can see for each category you will get 10 to 20 content ideas so in this way it will help you to build topical map around your niche or your main target keyword i hope you understood how it will look if we will enable the topical map option so now i'm going to show you if we will not enable this topical map option then how it will look if i will disable it then it will look something like this when you will do keyword research then it will look something like this now you can divide your keyword based on intent like informational customer investigation shopping and all these things and if you want then you can select keywords in cluster range how many keywords you want in each cluster and there is search volume if you want that uh, surfer seo will show you only those keywords which have 100 plus traffic okay volume then in this in that case you can select it from here and you can apply it okay i hope you got it so as you can see it divided all the keywords intent based if we will not enable topic map option then it will divide our keyword based on the intent okay as you can see like informational customer investigation and all these things so it will divide all our keyword based on their intent so let me open any of this so for example if i I will open let's say this one weight loss pill so just click on this edit button and it will show you all the keywords okay and there's monthly search volume msv mean month monthly search volume and keyword difficulty from 0 to 10 if it is higher then it is difficult to rank if it is less than 5 then it is easy to rank i hope you understood so in this way you can do keyword research with surfer seo so let's move on to our next tool which is content editor tool i want to mention that content editor and 
content audit tool are my favorite tool content editor is used for optimizing new article if you are planning to write new article then you can optimize it using content editor and if you want to update your existing article which is not ranking well on google then you can in that case you can use this content audit option so for now i am going to open this uh, content editor tool and i am going to give you surfer seo content editor tutorial okay so i have created a separate video on surfer seo content editor tutorial if you want to watch that video then i will give the link of that video in the i button okay and also in the video description so you can watch that video after watching this video okay so when you will click on the surfer seo content editor option then you will see a dashboard like this which you are seeing in the screen right now so there are two main options write yourself and write with ai so if you want to write your article yourself then in that case you can select write your self option and if you want that surfer seo will write fully seo optimized article for you then in that case you can use write with ai but in that case you have to purchase surfer ai credits which will cost you 19 dollar per article it means that for writing one article it will cost you 19 dollar but if you are writing your article yourself then you don't need surfer ai credit okay so for example if i want to write an article about how to lose weight without exercise so i can write how to lose weight without sorry weight without exercise okay and after that what i can do i can just simply click on this create for one content editor credit and it will start doing research for this article so i have already created one for you so let me open this okay after opening your document it will look something like this surfer seo content editor will give you seo score from 0 to 100 if it is above 70 then it is very good you can publish it on your website so always try to get at least 70 plus score in surfer seo okay so let me explain what is inside this surfer seo content editor so first of all uh, you can start writing your article here as you can see and there are lots of things here as you can see surfer seo gives a score from 0 to 100 0 is the lowest and 100 is the highest so always try to get at least 70 plus score in surfer seo and surfer seo also suggest you word count so you don't need to think about what should be your uh, article length so if you are using surfer seo then surfer seo will do all the hard work for you so it it is suggesting that your article should be of 2600 to 3000 plus word and uh, you should have 23 to 47 subheadings in your article and you should have at least 42 paragraphs in your article and one more thing images it is suggesting that uh, you should have 14 to 34 images in your article as you can see here we are writing an article about how to lose weight without exercise that is we are talking about weight loss then how google will understand that you are actually writing an article about weight loss so what what Google will do Google will check all the NLP and TF IDF terms in your article related to weight loss like if you are talking about weight loss then Google want to see some related words in your article like uh, nutrition exercise fast food water running and all these things so uh, if your article has all these words related words then Google will think that your article is about weight loss and it will give you a ranking boost okay so you don't need to think about what are the words you should add in your article because surfer seo will do all the hard work for you as i already told you so let me show you how to lose weight without exercise okay healthy weight weight management weight loss journey body weight gain weight mindful eating physical activity fiber rich foods weight loss strategies blood sugar healthy diet processed food healthy diet poor sleep whole foods balanced diet and all these things so if you so if you are thinking that how surfer seo is bringing all this data so let me tell you uh, let me show you actually so surfer seo will do complete research on top ranking article for your target keyword so our target keyword is how to lose weight without exercise so surfer seo will check all the top 10 ranking article on google and it will automatically select some of uh, the top ranking article based on their seo score surfer seo score as you can see so it has picked number one number two ranking number three number four ranking article and number seven ranking article so surfer seo will suggest everything based on this this selected competitors okay so surfer seo will suggest everything based on this selected articles it is suggesting word count so what it will do it will take uh, the average of all the selected competitors and then it will suggest you what should be your word count similarly it will check the number of images in all this article and it will suggest how many images you should add in your article and similarly it will do complete research in this selected articles and then it will suggest what are the things you should have in your article like uh, 
your word count, number of paragraphs, number of subheadings, number of images, and all the NLP and TF-IDF terms. Suppose if you want to deselect any of the competitor, if suppose if I want to, suppose I want suggestions based on only this competitor, then I can deselect all other competitors and I can select only this one. Okay, I hope you got it. And one more thing, I want to mention one more thing. So if you want that Surfer SEO will generate entire article outline for you, then you can click on this insert outline button and it will insert outline. So as you can see, after inserting the outline score went from 0 to 31 so why this score is improved from 0 to 31 because surfer SEO has naturally mentioned some of these terms in this subheadings okay so as you can see it covered weight loss without exercise weight loss uh, without emotional eating processed food whole grain and uh, practical mindful eating sugar drink and all these things it has covered some of these words in this subheading so that's why score has improved from 0 to 31 so when you will follow all this instruction and uh, like word count subheadings paragraphs number of images and you will cover all these words naturally then your score will definitely go beyond 70 plus okay i hope you got it so our next tool is content audit tool so when you will click on it then you will see a dashboard like this suppose if any of your website article is not ranking well on google then in that case what you can do you can insert the url of that article in this uh, in the url field and you can enter your target keyword for which you want to rank that article and you can click on this create content audit button when you will do it then it will check the top 10 ranking article and compare your article with other top ranking articles then it will suggest you what you should add or remove from your article to improve your ranking so let me show you a quick demo for example i have written an article about affiliate lab review if i want to improve its ranking so so i have created a content audit for this article so first thing it is showing that my content score is 77 which is very good so but still it is not ranking so there are something uh, which i should add or remove from my article so let's see what we can add or remove from this article so very first thing is internal linking so it will suggest you from which article you can add internal link to this affiliate lab review article and the next thing is terms to use okay just click on this action button okay so it will suggest you what are the words missing in your article for example i should add Add words like affiliate marketing business affiliate marketing course and also I should remove this word affiliate lab because I have overused it I have used this word 99 times but my competitors which are ranking on Google have used only 40 to 59 times uh, throughout the article so definitely I should remove it similarly I have uh, used affiliate lab course word seven times in my article but my competitors have added this word two to four times so I should definitely remove it and similarly uh, I have not added the word affiliate SEO in my article but my competitors have used three to five times in their article so similarly i can understand what are the nlp terms and tf idf terms that i should either add or remove from my article to make it more seo fan friendly and it should look natural in the eye of google okay so this is the very important thing you should follow it next thing is word count so it is suggesting that i should add 2000 to 7000 words in my article currently my article length is 504 thousand plus word but it is suggesting that i should add 2000 to 7000 words in my article why just click on show details and as you can see number one article has 10000 word number two article uh, ranking article has 3000 at approximately 4000 word in my article and my article has only 5000 words so it is taking the average of these two article and it is suggesting that i should add 2000 more word in my article i hope you got it similarly there are some uh, suggestions like i should add uh, 264 to 360 69 words in my subheadings and uh, all these things as you can see and it is suggesting that i should add 33 to 44 subheadings in my article why so let's click on show details and as you can see number one ranking article on google has 54 subheadings number two ranking article on google has 55 subheadings so it is taking the average of this two and it is suggesting that i should add 33 to 44 subheadings in my article why because my article has only 22 subheadings okay so it is suggesting that i should add more sub headings in my articles i hope you got it similarly there are lots of lots of recommendation as you can see if you will follow all this recommendation and apply in your article then there is chance that your article ranking will definitely improve because uh, what you are doing here uh, you are checking the top ranking article and you are trying to make your article similar to top ranking article google is ranking any article in in google then there is something in that article that google actually wants. so what surfer seo is doing here it is suggesting that how we can make 
make our article similar to this already ranking article so that our ranking will improve i hope you understood so next tool is domain planner tool it is i think not useful tool but still i want to mention what is the use of this tool so this tool basically scan all your article and uh, it will show surfer seo score for all your article so you can understand uh, for which article your surfer seo score has uh, lower than 50 or 40 then you can optimize that article using surfer seo so let's move to next uh, tool which is surf analyzer tool what surf analyzer tool will do it will analyze the surf for your target keyword for example if i want to check which article are ranking in surf for increased weight loss traffic and what are their word counts uh, heading structure and all these things then what i can do i can simply write increase website traffic and i can click on this create surf analyzer and it will take surfer seo one to two minute to analyze the surf for this given keyword so i have already created one for you so let me open this so when you will open it then you will see a dashboard like this so as you can see it is suggesting that average word count of uh, number one to number 10 article is 4500 words so if you are planning to write a new article then you should definitely try to achieve at least 4000 to 5000 words in your article because average word count of uh, number one to number 10 ranking article is 4500 words so you should definitely try to achieve this word count if you want to rank your article and uh, you can check the pattern like uh, number 11 to number 20 article has only 3700 words number page 3 ranking article has average word count of uh, 2700 words so in this way you can understand this SERP results okay and if you want to compare your article with top ranking articles then you can do it uh, using this option you can enter your website URL uh, here uh, if you have suppose you have written an article about increased weight uh, website traffic then you can enter your website URL here and you can click on compare to get an idea like uh, what you should add or remove from your article similar to content audit tool and there are keyword sections so if you want to know what for which keywords these articles are ranking and if you want to do a complete keyword research then for this increased website traffic then you can click on this keywords and if you uh, want to add FAQs in your article and you want to get some questions idea then you can click on questions and you will get a uh, lots of good ideas you can add some of this uh, questions in your article naturally and you can rank for this keywords and what are the uh, popular words phrases and common words you should have in your article you can check it from here and number of common backlinks they have in top ranking article you can check everything uh, it means that you can analyze the entire SERP result using this tool SERP analyzer tool you can check everything like uh, how many bold words they have used uh, how many titles they have used how many subheadings they have used and all these things if you want to um, know everything about SERP result you want to analyze the SERP result then in that case you can use this uh, Surfer SEO SERP analyzer tool. So I hope you found this Surfer SEO tutorial and demo helpful. If you want to try Surfer SEO for free then I will give the link of Surfer SEO free trial in the video description. Just check it and use it for free and decide Surfer SEO is good for you or not. If you have any confusion then please let me know by comment below. I will reply as soon as possible. Thank you for watching friends. See you in my next video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching friends.